still in France, and it's been two weeks since Gaston passed away. It's been seven weeks since my mom died. Even though I feel incredibly sad, I feel also incredibly inspired. Na 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 na. Listen. But here's the thing. This isn't about making some archival piece of art that's gonna hang on a wall in a museum. I mean, if the Louvre calls, hello? I've got art. <sighs> I was looking at this piece of wood and thinking about something I could make with it. Maybe splattering some paint on it. What I think the photo needs to be of is this pear tree right here. This pear tree has been in this yard for five generations. Amazing. And now six. And now six. I have this video that I took when I first got here. When I arrived, the tronc was like that. Comme il était malade à la hache, oui. bang, bang, bang. j'ai tout nettoyé, j'ai mis un traitement dessus de façon à ce que ça tienne, et puis tu vois, il est repoussé. Wow. Il était haut comme ça quand je suis arrivé. Oh, do you have time to linger for just a little while out of your busy and very important day? the goldfinches that have gathered in a field of thistles for a musical battle to see who can sing the highest note or the lowest or the most expressive of mirth or the most tender. Their strong, blunt beaks drink the air as they strive melodiously, not for your sake and not for mine and not for the sake of winning, but for sheer delight and gratitude. Believe us, they say, it is a serious thing just to be alive on this fresh morning in this broken world. I beg of you, do not walk by without pausing to attend to this rather ridiculous performance. It could mean something. It could mean everything. It could be what Rilke meant when he wrote, you must change your life. Welcome to the garden. It is so beautiful here and peaceful and quiet and I've never really experienced life in this flow, in this pace of doucement, slower, slow down. I really don't know what I'm capable of under these circumstances. Art I make has always been a product of the chaotic environment that I'm in or the trauma that I'm enduring and, and right now I just feel like I just feel like I've landed inside of a Mary Oliver poem here. Who can sing the highest note? Who sings the lowest note? We didn't rehearse this, by the way. This is just the magic that happens. I mean, it's beautiful, it's tragic, it's temporary, it's ephemeral. It, I've never lived someplace so quiet before. I'm intrigued to see what it does to my art and my process. So I've been photographing this tree in all the seasons, majority of with my iPhone. Lens Baby, sweet 35 optic on there. I have been using Lens Babies since the beginning. Shout out to my buddy Craig. I brought all the photographic elements into Photoshop, did a little bit of a digital collaging and layering, and, and then my computer crashed. And basically I lost the entire top of the tree collaging. Tape, scissors, glue, let's make it happen. I took this new material and familiar things, book pages, and glue and paint and acrylic. I combined it all together to create this. And I love this piece. Limited edition on 17 by 24 inch paper, printed and signed by me. If you'd like to get in on that, there's a link in my profile. Thank you so much. As an artist, my job is to pay attention and capture and document and share these moments through my art. And these past 10 months have been filled with so many magical moments. So much darn beauty everywhere I look all the time, coupled with this tremendous sadness and grief and loss and anticipation of loss. And, and here I am with Felici. <laughs> Living this beautiful life. And so even though my heart is breaking and shattering, I can feel the light coming in and shining out. And you're an artist too. And this art project that you're working on, it's your life. So what do you wanna fill your days with? What do you wanna fill your pages with? Because life is so brilliantly short. 
my friend. It is just a flash. It's really step fully into your life right now as it is, even when it's uncomfortable. Perfect. If you want to be more intimately involved in what my process is as an artist and see over 50 posts that have never been published publicly, become an art patron. Details are in my profile. Thank you so much for watching. I'm Peggy Dyer. Walk through the world like you mean it, my friend. Peace.